what is up guys shugs here for uh another week of my uh mutt team and how i'm gonna have everything set up so i uh, just wanted to kind of start things off by saying i was trying to get this yesterday but my internet was out but i think in the future i'm gonna start doing them actually on mondays because mondays is like when all the team of the weeks come out so that kind of be like stuff that's happening right now so i'll probably start doing them monday nights to kind of show you guys uh kind of all the new stuff that's going on so uh first let's go ahead and get into the uh the lineup and uh i don't remember much from the last video but uh i remember i did talk about mariota um i originally got him and at first i didn't like him but then i tried him again and i really liked him um i got rid of my two legend linemen um mainly because they were selling for like 100k so i'm going i'm trying to go for more of the uh um chemistry um if you guys haven't heard, there's like this article on Mudhead that really kind of explains the chemistry really well. So, and I really like the long pass because I think route running is extremely important for how it gets you separation from man coverage. And man coverage seems to be like the uh, the most popular defense to play this year. So, um, yeah, I end up I've been playing with the Mariota a lot lately. Um, I actually do like him. Um, I'm probably gonna use him. So I guess someone else comes out that I like. I have the hide in the lineup, mainly just for the double cam, but um, I mainly just, I probably use Tomlinson more than the hide. I'm not a huge, huge fan of the hide. Uh, kind of kept the same receivers. Uh, Locke is more of a return guy, but, you know, White, Paraman, and Beckham, and I've been liking them just fine. Um, this De Castro uh, is actually not too bad. Um, I wanted to focus more on pass block since I do I primarily am, am doing pass block, but um, I like this catcher. Also, he's got 96 strength, so he's actually um, I mean he doesn't look great by the stats, but he's actually uh, he's actually been performing pretty well. So, and of course the Chris Clark, he's actually one pass block better I think than the uh, Jonathan Ogden, and um. I got this Thomas mainly to get me up to that 60 long pass because I don't want to have to pause the game. I tried doing that. It's just annoying pausing the game and going to change uh, your depth chart and stuff. So I want to keep it as much as being able to run it like this. So uh, And then on defensive side of the ball, um, I actually had a, a Captain Kendricks, but uh, I just ho I sold him because of the announcement that Ryan Shazier is going to be the rising star on Thursday. And... That card's gonna be amazing. I'm gonna run one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm gonna run eight of them because that's how awesome I think he's gonna be. Um, he's, I mean, his 73 card is good enough to use as a user, but that's insane. Um, but some of the updates I do, um, I got all the, the Damaris Randalls in. They're fine as backup safeties and corners, and then. Uh, I'm running kind of like a 3-4-4-3 three, four, four, three kind of hybrid right now. So um, I've actually really liked Miller and Arakpo. Um I started comparing like Bruce Smith and and uh, Jason Taylor's stats. Actually, a snap was doing it, and it kind of got to thinking. And uh, Vaughn Miller and Arakpo right now are the uh, the ones that we really like. Uh, I think what I really love about um, Arakpo is his strength and block shit at the end. As you see, you guys put on. Donald actually and it would be pretty good too so but uh um and then Miller you know Miller's got like you know 89 speed so definitely got a little bit more speed at the end I like Donald to run some a gaps with and then Brown just kind of he just destroys run play sometimes by himself and then you know I got the good Gregory's that's the uh the backups um oh and this Stefan Gilmore is a really really good card so I definitely recommend picking him up he's like 30k um that's pretty much how my team's looking right now um, sitting on 2.5, there hasn't been anything that has really kind of caught my eye. Um, I will be probably this weekend picking up. Um, if you guys didn't know, the uh, Amari Cooper had a big game because my Raiders finally won a game. Hallelujah. Can't believe it happened. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, he's he's just really high right now. Like, I'm going to get him and run him out in my slot over the Kevin White. But, uh he just, I'm not paying 100k for that card. If he falls down to like, kind of like what Mario did, like if he plunges down like the 40s, 50s, I'll probably pick him up, but uh, um, definitely not picking up right now. The Manziel is basically the Mariota, um, a little bit, um, a little bit better throw deep, but um, thing, even though it's, it's supposed to be not a real stat, the throwing accuracy, I think that matters because I remember Winston has like a higher throw short accuracy than Elway. 
but Winston can't throw the angle routes like Elway can. And Elway's throw accuracy is way higher. So I know it's supposed to be a fake snap, but maybe it is some sort of snap. But Mariota definitely short medium is pretty pretty on point. So um, as you can see, you know, they're they're pretty close, but uh, I'm I'm not gonna get get away from Mariota at this point. So now we'll go ahead. Uh, Roethlisberger is the hero. His card sucks <laughs> unless you're a huge Steelers fan. I don't recommend getting him. Um, none of these guys are very exciting. Um, maybe the Elliot, I guess, because he's a decent user. But I, mean, it, I don't know. This is this is a pretty dull week for Team of the Week, to be honest. I'm hoping that the Football Outsiders are a lot better. And of course, you know, we're waiting for the uh, Ryan Shazier. Um, I didn't do the hide double speed run and short pass because we have those bronze and silver ones that are souped up. You know, so I'm waiting for those. Let me show you guys my progress on the master. I'm getting I'm getting closer, guys. I gotta I got I've been kinda just combining badges as I go through seasons, so I'm for sure I'll have the next two just from combining them. Cause I gotta get a five more of these but yeah i mean i've been in a pretty good grind so far um i'm about yeah once i finish this season i'll have another one of these so then i'll have like four left let me double check i think i want to say i'll have another one of them let me check here how close it I, i'm getting pretty close I, I played a bunch tonight actually i wasn't able to play over the weekend so i tried to play a bunch tonight so yeah i'll have four more so i got my if i go undefeated i'll have it at, even if i don't go defeat if i just get my super bowl win That'll give me the four I need um, to get that one. So then I'll just need four more or less than to get my uh, the freaking Odell. So um, for the solos this week, the coin up sucked. Um, I need to do the team of the week challenge. Make sure you guys do those if you haven't you know, if you haven't been keeping up with them. Uh, try to do them. They'll probably bring them back. Still not touching the gauntlets, guys, until they change the presentation. I'm not going to spend hours doing that. But uh, yeah, guys, I am. Here, let me go show you guys the uh, the Shazier, just his gold Shazier. I mean, he's gonna be an 85 if you do the uh, the regular one. Like if you do the dual chems. So yeah, well, let's just look at look at here. We'll get one so it won't get out. Look at the stats on this dude. 91 speed, right? Already freaking awesome. 90 hit power. Great, amazing user. You know, he's gonna be getting a plus what a plus 12. So you know his speed's probably going to get bumped up. I think a 92, maybe 93 if we're lucky. But you know his like his block shed, strength, all that stuff's going to get bumped up. But then look at that. You know his excel is going to get bumped up. His catching's pretty good for a linebacker. You know what I mean but he's 97 jumping. Like guys, I'm telling you this this car <laughs> is going to be awesome. I mean I'm sure his play rec and zone, all that stuff's going to go up. But uh. I'm, I'm super excited about this car. This probably, we've been, I remember last year when he came out, we were really hoping to get a card for him, but uh, he ended up getting hurt. So, you know, this Shazier card is, I imagine he's going to stay pretty expensive, but I'm going to fork out 100, 150K, maybe 200K to, uh, I'm at least going to get four of them, you know, just to get the, uh, the double cams or whatever. But, uh, I want him also just to run his backups, come my linebackers, because he's, I think he's going to be a game changer. Um, he has, he's the epitome of a Madden linebacker. I'll probably still keep Barr, just because I like Barr too, but uh, yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to that Shazier. year, so uh, that's kind of uh, for this week, guys. Like I said, I'm going to start doing them on Monday nights. Um, if there's some comments you guys have about my team, um, why I don't have certain people, stuff like that, just leave Please leave some comments and I'll try to get to it in the next video. Uh, you guys haven't seen the bundle. The bundle really sucks today. You get like a badge topper, which we know is going to have four bronze, maybe a silver if you're lucky. So really, really disappointed. But uh, maybe they're kind of doing it to kind of help with the market recover because they've had like three weeks of nonstop just fire being released. So I'm hoping this weekend that they don't do. Um, a legend bundle because I can because I get these 50 legend badges just sitting waiting to kind of go back up and recover so uh, um, but that's pretty much it for this, this week guys um, tune in next week and I'll show you guys some of the changes and some of the new stuff that comes out and uh, you know we'll just kind of go go on this long long ride together but uh, that's what we're looking at right now and uh, I'm liking how it looks not too too many changes I make hopefully we'll get a corner here pretty soon maybe this Ravis Rowley's playing tonight 
But I uh, hope you guys have a great week and be safe out there.